First carp of the season. Here we go. First carp of the season. Sweet. Eric, grab the net. Oh, we have stuff in the way. This is going to be fun. Here we go. First carp of the season took off. Where is it? It's going to be right here. It's going to be right in front of us. It's not very big. Oh, it's a pretty little dude. Ready? Ready? Let's not lose it. It's the first one of the year, Eric. Let's get it out. Oh, it's in that line. Oh, no, it's not. It's out. There we go. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is why we're out here. It's not a very big one either. Here you go, put it ready? Get the net ready. Here you go. And go up, go up. There we go. Good job. Look at that. That is the first carp of the season. <laughs> Good job. Give me five. Bam. Look at that. No, leave it. Leave that one in there. Did it just get hit? Or did you kick the log? Did you kick it? Yeah? Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to make sure it wasn't getting hits. Look at that. That's a beauty. Not the biggest, but definitely a very pretty carp. Look at that. Very nice to being the first one of the season. Probably not over... Probably not bigger than two pounds, maybe three at the max. But let's find out and pull out the scale, which I found again, because we had lost this for a while. Let's make sure it's in pounds. There we go, pounds. Zeroed out, and let's go. Oh, look at that. 362, there we go. 362 for the first. Carp of 2019. What a beauty. So, get that rig back up, bait it back up, and throw them back out there. That one's still in the end. Uh, I'm going to leave it a little bit more if no hits. We'll rebait it, throw it back out there, and uh, first carp yeah, of 2019. So we're at Lake Mendo today. We got the first carp of the day already. I'm a little late on my intro, but we already got one. You guys will see that up next, but we are out here. Yes, it is really cloudy, and it is, it's starting to get a little bit better, but it was really cold, it's really windy, but the reason I had, when I first got here, I was like, oh, uh, I'm just going to try it out, I don't think I'm going to catch anything, but the reason I stayed is because I touched the water, and the water's actually a lot warmer than the, how it feels out here, so I expected the water to be freezing, it's actually really warm, so that keeps... That gives me hope that the carp are biting, are moving. So I stayed. I started throwing a couple casts. I want to go switch out one of my rods to put on a catfish rod out. When the black rod took off, we got hit. We got it. And I, I, instead of throwing out, I threw back out the black rod for carp. I, instead of throwing out the catfish rod, I threw the other carp rod out. So we're chilling here with two carp rods. Waiting for another one. And we are getting bites right now. This black one's getting hit. And I think that white one a few minutes ago was I saw it get hit. But oh, okay. So figures right now. Uh, you guys can't probably tell, but that line is what I call dancing when it's dropping down, popping back up, moving up and down. And that means it's getting hit. So let's we'll see how long it takes before it takes off. So So we're hooked up. I was just switching out that rod and I was going to throw out a ca uh, catfish rod. And I looked up and this thing was going off. It's not very big. But yeah, here we go. It's kind of cloudy and cold, but the water is really warm. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's actually a pretty nice one. Not bad. It's kind of beat up, it looks like, though. 
That was fun to do, try to fight a fish and put on my GoPro at the same time. Oh, there we go. That's a beauty of a carp. That right there is a really nice carp. Another thing I think I'm gonna do is instead of switching off to enjoying a catfish rod, I think I'm gonna stick the carp. There we go. Very pretty carp. that so I'm not keeping any today but look at these Ooh, hey oh 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 you just went down to the ground hard I think different to what everybody think carp are actually really really resilient fish bye There he goes. Well, that was fun. I think instead of throwing out the second catfish rod, I'm just gonna keep throwing for carp. Cause we just got one and that was really fun. That was, got, a, got my heart pumping. So I think we're gonna stick to carp. No. No. It just got really, really hard hit though. Really hard hit. So, this drag just got really loose. And it's still loose. I think it might be running towards me. Yeah. There we go. That's what I thought. That's exactly what I thought. That drag got really loose right after I said this just got a hit and turned back off the GoPro. I noticed that dra drag just dropped really quick. I was like, no, this thing's running towards me. This thing took off really hard, turned around, came right towards me. Oh, let's try to keep it out of the other line because that other line's still getting hit. Oh my god. I don't think it's very big, but... I forgot how hard they fight. <laughs> Stay out of that line. Ooh, actually, it's not that bad. It's actually a little bit bigger than the last one. Nope. Thing's about the same size. This is why we're out here, though. Because these are big, stiff rods, and look how it just bends this thing. And it's not very big either. Just thinks so much power. Crazy how much power these things have. There we go. That's number two for the day. Crazy, crazy, crazy. This is what we're here though. Look at that. Right in the corner of the lip. Pops right out. Like I said, we're not keeping any today. Nope, nope I'm not. Oh, and I dropped two today. The second one I drop. But look how pretty these fish are. Ugh. They're just so powerful. Such a beautiful fish. We're going to release this one over here so we can kind of watch it swim away. And he's gone. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, let me get that rig back up. Going back out there, that other one was still getting hit. So, see if we can get any more. As you guys can see, 
the sun is kind of starting to come out. It's getting nice and sunny out. It's starting to warm up. It actually feels really good. It went from like, it's okay, like not bad. Like I don't need a sweater to like, ah, I just got really warm. Like it got nice and toasty. It feels good. So the sun just came out. That rod's getting hit. This one just went up. Oh, 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 oh. You guys see that? Not sure if you did, but that one just got hit really well. Really good. Um, so... We're still getting hit, sun's coming out, it's starting to feel nice, so maybe the sun will get them to start biting a little bit more than they have. Maybe not, I don't know. We got two so far, so let's see what else we can get. It's gonna be a little bit different because I was trying to get this set up, but I didn't even get a chance to get it set up. So, let's just hope this doesn't fall in the water. Hey guys. So I was trying to get it set up on the tripod, but as I was getting it set up, this rod took off, and uh, I didn't get a chance to. <gasps> well, <laughs> we lost it. Popped off. I got to see it right over there. We lost it. Kind of took off from here. Boom! Over to where those logs are right here. And it popped off. Oh, there you go. It's kind of hard to see right. There we go. So, let me give this one right, right back up. This one's still in the water. And I see if I can get this set up. I'm trying to... Because when I... I used to do videos a long time ago. I think it was a few years ago when I first started my YouTube channel. I put it on the GoPro mount on a log. And that's how we used to do it when I think the first video Oscar was ever in the that tree over there, a big log I'd put it on. See this three of them in. I was gonna try to do that, but I didn't even get a chance when we got hooked up. So let me see if I can uh, get this all set up. So I think we have it. Oh my god, it scared me. I thought it popped off. So I think we have a big one on. Oh no. Oh, it's a big one. It's a big one. Oh my god. It's a really big one, you guys. This is not even going to fit in the net, dude. This is so big. I mean, I'll try to net it. I mean, it's going to be my best shot, dude. Oh my god, I hope you guys can see this in the camera. Look at that, you guys. Holy smokes. Holy freaking smokes right now. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my freaking goodness. Ugh. Look at that. Look at the size of this carp. That is the first good carp of 2019. It's a really chunky one too. Holy smokes that took off. 
and that took off hard. You guys see that? Look at that. Let me get this, this let me get this baby on. Oh my god. Yeah. Damn, look at the how strong these hooks are. Look at that. Stayed intact almost. Yeah, intact, dude. Oh my god. Look at the size of this carp. That is a monster freaking carp right there, you guys. If you want to, talk, if you guys want to talk about a big carp, that's a big carp. I had to chase this down way over there, made sure it didn't get into all that, all that, all those logs and stuff that's over there. That is a big carp. This has to be one of the biggest carps. I mean, I'll get a weight on it, but. I got it. I say this is over 10 pounds. I think this is over 10 pounds. Here you go, look at my scale. Ugh, don't bump away. Ooh, don't bump away, please. That is scale. Okay. Zero, zero, zero pounds. Calm down. It's okay, buddy. Oh, yeah. Over 10 pounds, you guys. Let's go. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Just stop. Oh, there we go. It has locked. Like I said, over 10 pounds. That is 11.16, 11 pounds, 16. That is one crazy carp right there, you guys. That thing took off so hard. Look at this, you guys. That is right there. One crazy carp. Look at the size of this baby. If you guys could look at the size of that mouth, he has a crazy freaking mouth. Look at look how. See if I can get to open. Look how big that is. That is. I like him when they stick their dorsal fin up. Let me see if I can get him to keep it up. No, I can't. Let me see if I can get it. No, but look at that. That is one crazy carp. My other rod, the rod I just caught this guy off of is still in the, uh, still out, so I gotta get that rig back up and throw him back out there. The other one's still in, so I should probably check the bait on that one and throw it back out, but I don't know because I just threw it in, so I think I'm gonna keep this baby. I've been releasing all the little ones today and releasing all the ones I caught, but they are an invasive species, so these big girls like these produce way too many eggs, so male or female not sure but i'm gonna keep this guy so ah <sighs> beautiful oh, my gopro just died as soon as i got hooked up with this one and i'll tell you guys what it's it's, a, it's another good one it's a hundred percent another good one look at that dude Goodness. It's another good one. And my GoPro just died. Oh no, oh no. Only second I can take you guys with me this time. <laughs> my net. I don't have my net. Oh, that's another good one. I love that. Dude. 
dude. Oh my goodness. Let me try to bring it over here so I can at least grab my net. I'll be back in a second. Dude, it's a nice one. It's not as big as the last one, but it's definitely really big. My arm's starting to get tired. Oh, I don't like that. There we go. Oh my God, dude, holy smokes, look at that, look at the size of this freaking carp, dude, look at that freaking carp. Look at that big one, dude, look at that girth. Not as big as the last one, but I, it's way heavier. I can almost guarantee that. Look at that. Look at that girth on that one. Look at that. Dude, that's my hand. Oh, you guys can't really tell, but I'm going to bring it over here. I'll put it on my backpack. I'll show you guys, see if I can set it up. Stop recording. Uh, hope you guys can sh hope I just can show you guys. Oh. Stop, 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 stop. Look at that, dude. Now that's a freaking carp. Look at that girth. That's a huge freaking carp. Can I take a picture? Yeah, no problem. Actually, I took a picture of you. That's fine. From a distance. It's fine. Ooh. How much do you think it weighs? Oh, I don't know. But I think it's over 10 pounds. It's, it's close to 10 pounds. The last one I had, the other one I have in there is for sure 10 pounds. What do you do with them? Uh, I give them to uh, people. I know a lot of my family like to eat them. There's uh, a lot of catfish, isn't there? Where? In this lake or right here. Yeah, there's, there's quite a bit of catfish. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's a big boy. I think it's a girl. I think she's getting ready to spawn because of that, the size of her. You want to see the ones I already took? Sure. Should I get you in a picture though? Hold That's it fine. Pick you. That's amazing. It's almost pretty in a way. But yeah, you... they're super pretty fish. I love how they have a, if you can tell, they have that brown and it kind of transferred into a gold to an orange tail. I, what I really like though is I'm from Florida. Yeah. Bass do nothing for me. It's trout. <laughs> That's really? just so fucking hard to catch. Yeah. If you go up to uh, there's these places uh, in Talmadge. Oh, Shoot I go feet. there all yeah. the time. I know Mill Creek. Fish. Yeah, Mill Creek Dam. That shoot, place is really. They shoot them in through a hose. Yeah. Uh, and they tr and they're swimming up yeah. that little. There you go. Zero zero, zero point zero zero pounds. I'm sure, you guys can see that. I'm gonna get this up here and uh I say this has to be a oh wow nice oh not quite ten I hate this one this is let's see come on lock it is locked it is nine pounds forty seven nine that's a point big, 47. Get to like 50. Yeah, they grow really big. I believe the state record for a state of California is 50 pounds. Oh. Yeah, so 9.47. Yeah, catfish get really yeah, big too. Fucking huge. So, uh, 9.47. We got two really nice carp. GoPro died, so I'm gonna call it a day. We're gonna go home. Yeah. I charge it a lot now. This is just whatever. Yeah. You ought to go home, get the GoPro charge, and see if we can come back later.